Hello everyone, oh, hello everyone, welcome to Three Houses Randomized. We are back, I took a day off yesterday because um, I wasn't really feeling up to it. I kind of had a long, I wasn't really feeling too good yesterday so I decided to take a rest. It was a Sunday and I decided, you know what, I'm just gonna chill, get some sleep and, uh, and kind of have like a self care day. Clean the house, take a bath, get a workout in, not in that order because that would make no sense, but you know what I mean, but we're back here we're on chapter five. We're still on hard mode because I just realized I was supposed to switch to maddening, but I didn't do, but we're gonna keep going. Today's gonna be a fun one because we get to find out who Gilbert is. And if you guys know that I am going to actually replace I have a new mission the for character, you, or not replace, make him playable. Like for hey Teach, I gotta say, I never would have guessed you were a descendant of the King of Liberation. You didn't forget, did you? That story I told you about a relic that could cut a mountain in half? That relic was the Sword of the Creator, the very same used by Nemesis, the King of Liberation. <laughs> Don't be coy, Teach. The Sword of the Creator could only be wielded by Nemesis. If you can use it too, that can only mean that's you a have lie. Lines crushed. <laughs> that's a lie, Gerald. <laughs> Fine, keep your secrets. But speaking, he probably wants to examine your crest with those. If it isn't my little Claude. What has you so well? Whoa! Judith? What are you doing here? That's Lady Judith to you, boy. I told you. Okay, I did not see- I forgot that Judith was even in this scene. All due respect. <laughs> anyway, I'm here to retrieve you. Duke Regan's condition has taken a turn for the worse. Are you saying the old man's on his deathbed? No, it's not that bad. But in the state he's in, he won't be able to participate in the next roundtable conference. He wants you to go in his stead. I volunteered to play the messenger. Well, thanks for that. Oh, and uh, Teach, this is Judith, also known as the Handman, the hero of Daphnil. So you're little Claude's teacher, are you? How much trouble has he been giving you? Plenty. If her nickname didn't give it away, you should know that Judith, uh, Lady Judith, is the leader of the famous House Daphnil of the Leicester Alliance. She used to be a big deal at the roundtable conferences, but it seems of late she's been reduced to a mere... You had better shut that mouth before Ooh. I put my boot in it, you tactless nuisance. Now come on, let's get going. Sorry, Professor, but I need to borrow the boy for a bit. Now imagine all those lines in a really, like, embe embellished, like, flowery, like, Shakespearean way of talking. I suppose we'll have to finish our chat later. Sorry, Teach. But don't you worry. I'll be back in time for our next mission. All right, Judith, let's, let's get, going. get going. It's Lady. <laughs> uh, I suppose you are the active leader for the time being. Fair enough, boy. Fair enough. <laughs> Clever boy. Good of you to come, Professor. I've heard much about you lately. Specifically, that you are able to awaken the sword of the Creator's power. I had, of course, seen your crest before. Eventually, it, in other words, after this dis However, a crest, a crest of... Your ability to wield the sword of the Creator, a legendary power. There can be no doubt that... <laughs> I don't know if anyone can like unlock the power because even people without people with the mystery crest, they won't be able to like have it really glowy. Duke Iyer, what's up, bud? <laughs> ah, it's you. Where I'm going is hardly your business. Do me a favor and mind your own, won't you? Sassy, sassy Duke. I somehow doubt your sincerity. My intuition says you'll keep nosing into what I'm doing. So, what's your deal? Worried about my well-being? Knowing where I come from, it makes sense you wouldn't be. A leisurely stroll about town in the middle of the night is obviously nothing new for me. There's no slowing me down tonight. <laughs> I've got important things to attend to right now. There you go with that nose of yours. It still isn't your business. But it looks like you won't let me leave until I tell you. You'll get your way this time. There's a dispute. Or maybe treachery is the more fitting word. Regardless, a purge is required. 
I see I've got to spell it all out for you. One of my goons double-crossed the gang. He absconded with his boss's small fortune, my small fortune, and buddied up with another gang. Members of the gang are recognizable by their scorpion tattoos. Suffice it to say, they're not a group you want to tangle with. Despite that, I'm not about to just roll over and play dead on this. So I figured I'd pay them a little visit, have a spot of tea with their boss. Makes sense, you know? Like I'm not aware? <laughs> wow, friend. You clearly underestimate me. I am an avid teacher. I play tea my drinker. cards wisely. I wouldn't play if there wasn't any hope of winning. Sounds kind of fun. <laughs> it won't be. One false move, and the walls will be painted. Aw, satire. Still sound fun. Better head off now. I've got people waiting for me just outside of town. See you around. <sighs> what is it you're after? Money? Me? Or are you just looking for someone to kill? You seem adamant. So, I'll allow it. Won't hurt to have backup if things go south. I trust you, for now. But I don't know how reliable you actually are. Just so we're clear. You mess with any of my people. I'll slit your throat without hesitation. Got that? I am your teacher, so maybe you shouldn't threaten me. <laughs> Duke Iyer. Not very nice of you to do, I'm just saying. Whose birthday is it? Judith! All right, let's do this. Judith, tea time. All right, let's bust this out. Manuela, tea party. All right. What are we saying here? What's your go-to? Mint leaves? Thank you for your invitation. To what do I owe this surprise? <sighs> What a lovely smell. I like this tea very much. You have my thanks. Wait, what? Judith also has tea lines too? It's good. How about that? I didn't know that. Really? Bodlin's future? No. I heard some gossip. <laughs> wow, I did not know this. I know that Sothis and uh, Gerald had it, but I didn't know Judith had it too. How about that? Really? really? Your ambitions? Nah. The ideal professor. Oh. Really? First crushes? <laughs> Talking about your old flames, Judith. Am I that terrible of a woman? <laughs> so I'm a little unkempt, what of it? Uh, admonish or disagree? Oh. oh. Strangely fits. Ooh, what fun. What fun. Really? Whoa. Whoa. Look at her eyebrows. Wait, was that a funky eyebrow look? Every rose has its thorn. Every beautiful leg should have a dagger, don't you think? <laughs> oh, what fun. <laughs> look at her eyebrows. They're like... Like, I don't even know. Does Manuel even do that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the? What the? Was she about to say what the f? What the? Hold on, I have to. I have to listen to that again. Oh, what fun! What? What? What the? She was about to say what the fuck. She was about to say it. You cannot deny that. She was about to say that. Look at her face. She's like so confused. I love her eyebrows. Oh, what fun. 
Wow. You can't be serious. <laughs> what the She was about to say it. I no, she was about to say it. She was about to say what the fuck. I'm not I am not unbelieving that. Smells lovely. <laughs> Judith, what the? F Thanks for the treat. Come by the infirmary anytime you need anything. I'll be waiting, Professor. Okay. All right, Judith. And we also get to find out who uh, Gilbert randomized into. We've got some certs to do as well. Can I recruit them? Oh, I can't recruit them just yet. Oh, we have a quest here. Uh, well, actually, okay, hold on. Let's figure out where. Let's go to. What the? <laughs> so you have a crest too, eh, Professor? Does that mean you're descended from nobility? You've certainly got the look. You think? For it. A teacher, a mercenary, and so very mysterious. How could a girl ever get Chill enough? out, Manuela. <laughs> I do find you very... Hmm. Manuela. <laughs> I think she'd be cool in Dorothea's palette. Professor. Professor, it also re... Huh? Mm. Professor, it also... What's up, bro? Hey, Professor. Don't you think everyone's making too big a fuss over these crests or heroes relics or whatever they're called? How important can that stuff really be? Personally, I don't even care that I don't have a crest. Yeah, you have a death mask. I'll take muscles over crests any day. Heck, I'll take muscles over a hot I'll meat. take muscles over... Huh? Murders, though? Death knights? Um, this way is where Gilbert will be. Hey there. Uh. Gwendol. I have never had goings to the kingdom's north. Professor, you can't. Training has butts. Dex and riding. Nadir, what's up, bro? I'm gonna keep training until I can beat you. Hey, Professor. No? Strength and brawl. Um, I don't want to like, yeah, I, I actually have to go this way entirely, because that's where the Knight's Hall is or whatever, this one. This is where Gilbert will be. Spotted Pilardo. That's right. Hey, bud. It seems that our next mission is another bandit hunt. This time I've heard that their leader is the son of a noble family. <laughs> What a complete disgrace to the nobility. I wonder who it is, Sylvain. Here we go. <gasps> no! The King of Thrones has returned? Yes. Hail, Professor. If I may introduce myself, I am Gilbert. My life has been spent as a dedicated knight. I am to accompany you on your assignment. No way! I may have slowed a step in recent years, but I pledge to you the full extent of my abilities. Unreal. No, Professor. That is awesome! So now we have Edelgard's dad, Edelgard, Claude, and- No, never mind, we killed Claude. We'll never get Claude. <laughs> I thought I had something going there, but we don't. Professor, please leave Sylvain alone for the time being. The thing is, the big- Hi, Professor. I've actually got- Yeah, Sylvain sounded pretty pissed off about <laughs> that noble, or that, un that former noble, or whatever. I could use your help. I could use your help. Could you help me out? All right, let's um. Hey, hey! Do these quests. 
Hey, Solon. Why is that fish so still? Wait, is it swimming sideways? Perhaps, perhaps it is resigned to its woeful fate of being plucked from the water and eaten. Ah, oh, Professor, <laughs> you are. I would like to have more. Oh, get that out of your face! Oh, I am certain. <laughs> No. Fine. My mistake. The next mission is to rout bandits in the kingdom, is it not? I find the idea unsettling. Though the bandits have captured a large prize, that the matter I grant that I fear. Hey, Judith! It's awful. Just awful what happened with the right of rebirth. The infirmary. Well, it was a mess. Things are finally calm again. Let me tell you. Still, we can't lose them, Professor. I got this. I got this, man. Don't worry about it. Maybe. I'm not secretly eating it. I'm sorry. I kind of wish you could be able to organize this stuff. I've been, I've been looking for it. It's been outside the entire time. All right, I'm going to make a cut, and then we're going to have every, every all the quests done. So I'll be right back. Uh, we have a date with Archbishop. I'm pleased to have been invited. Very refined Caspar, the Archbishop. Thanks! Thanks. <laughs> Hopefully I get this right. I haven't really checked the dialogue or whatever. Huh? I get it now. Nice. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. I know what Ray is thinking. I sense great potential in you. You possess something extraordinary. Thanks. Perfect. I get it now. Whoa. It will be nice to gain a better understanding of each other. Epic. Got it. Got the win. How quickly this delightful time has passed. However, we must return to our work. I agree. I'm glad I asked you. So I forgot that Rodrigue was here. And guess who Rodrigue is? <laughs> it's Baby Lith. Well, I'm pretty sure got a little short. Nope, Baby Lith is the same height. She's just really tiny compared to Dudu. So, Rodrigue is, uh, is Flash's dad. That's nice. <laughs> I am Rodrigue Achille Fraudarius. I bear the great honor of serving as a lord in the kingdom of Fargus. I have come in Margrave Gautier's stead to retrieve their stolen relic. However, as I hear it, a group of students is to attend to this matter. I sincerely hope no harm comes to any of them. Hello. <laughs> oh. Hello. The head of the Western Church holds the title of bishop. That's not as distinguished as an archbishop. So if someone in there are bishop, they are under the. Hmm. Some people in some. Sun and summer. Oh. I'm glad I asked you. All right. Sedith is hanging out. Hey, I wanted to ask you to join me, but I got Oh, this is actually kind of sad. So, here I am. 
I was thinking we should visit your mother. She's resting beneath this humble grave. Hmm? Oh, of course you would ask that. I wouldn't know where to begin. I suppose I haven't talked much about her. She was gentle and smart. Oh, so smart. A wonderful cook. Always kind to everyone. And she loved flowers. Whenever I brought her back an unusual flower, her face would light up. I cherish those memories. <laughs> I can't count how many times she made me happy just by smiling. And she smiled the most when she was pregnant with you. She died right after you were born. She wasn't able to spend much time with you. But she loved you with all her heart. That's the truest thing I know. Never forget it. This ring is the only keepsake I have of her. One day, I hope you'll give this ring to someone you love as well as I love her. Ah, I appreciate sad. it. It's kind of sad because it's like kind of in line with the vanilla game almost. We got a support over here though. Guess whose birthday it is? It's Duke Guyers. That's whose birthday it is. All right, Duke Iyer. What's your go-to, mister? You asked me here for a reason, yeah? Well, at the very <laughs> least, this should be interesting. He actually, like, wears the... He actually kind of looks like a trickster to begin with. You know what I mean? Like, the top collar and that kind of thing. The popped collar, I mean. Oh, Iyer. My mans. Look at the happy guy. If I established a monopoly on tea, I imagine I'd see no end to the gold. <laughs> ah, never mind me. <laughs> what is your deal? Do you always stare so openly? <laughs> if you insist on it, you'll need to give me something in return. Look at the shiny bald head. <laughs> he polishes that bad boy every morning and I... <laughs> Charming, aren't I? I'm certainly not above using that charm to get what I want. What is your deal? Do you always stare so openly? <laughs> if you insist on it, You'll need to give me something Jeez, in return. Louise, that's so it's funny. lukewarm. Charming, aren't I? I'm certainly not above it. <laughs> cool. Thanks for the treat, friend. Let's do this again sometime, yeah? I love how Irish is so yeah. sassy. <laughs> Let's do this. Sorry you're stuck with me. It's finished. I think I get it now. I feel like I not a total a bit more skill. Okay, gang, I think we're gonna wrap it up here. Uh we're going to continue on for the next Ooh. We'll continue on next time when we beat the map of uh when we play and figure out who Miklon is. This is kind of a short a short episode, but that's okay. Um, and we'll uh, continue on tomorrow. So guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I thought this one was pretty fun. We got some we got some tea parties, had some funny dialogue quotes. We found out who both Rodrigue and 
Um, uh, Gilbert was. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, folks, hope you have a good uh, beginning of your week. I think it's Monday, right? Today's Monday? Yeah, today's Monday. And I'll see you in the next one. Deuces. Thank you.